Twigs, thank you for coming yeah. to the Enemy Awards. Have you had a good night so far? Oh, I've had a magical night, yeah. Who have you been hanging out with? Who have you seen? Um, I met Taylor Swift, that was fun. Okay, <laughs> what did you talk about with Miss Swift? Um, she said that she liked my music, which was nice. Did you <laughs> repay the compliment? Yeah, she's amazing, an amazing artist. Is this your first time at the Enemy Awards? Yes. And what do you make of it? Um, it's pretty wild, isn't it? What's the wildest thing you've seen? Um, well, I think there was a riot before I went on stage. That was tell us more. I've been listen, up here, so you no, seen no, no, listen. I think it's for someone else to tell. Okay, <laughs> What's been right. I'm very intrigued now. Um, Emily Evis won our Godlike Genius Award tonight for Glastonbury. Tell me about your experience of Glastonbury. Have you played before? Do you love the festival? And if so, why? What do you love about it? I think Glastonbury is a really um, special and quite ethereal festival. I've played there once, and I played at um, Sunset. And it was just such a beautiful show and there's amazing like ley lines that um, go under the ground there. And actually when I finished my album, there's a ley line um, which is, I think it's where Mary Magdalene's ley line meets St. Michael's. And I went on a pilgrimage there to um, thank Mary Magdalene for inspiration of my album. So yeah, I love Glastonbury, vibey. Did you feel the energy? Yeah, it's cool. It's a cool place. Glastonbury always does really well in terms of kind of a male-female split for okay. festivals, and there's been a lot of stuff about Reading and Leeds Day announcing mm. their lineup and it being very male-heavy. Mm. Is that something that you care about, the kind of split between genders at festivals, and what do you think can be done I think to redress the balance? I think that there's loads of incredible female artists, and they should be mm-hmm. highlighted. And um, yeah, of course. When are we going to hear new music? I know there's only just been new music, but are you working on new stuff at the moment or are you well, just like full on touring? I just put out an album two months ago. I, think, I know, so. but <laughs> I want to know right, how prolific you are. Is okay. there kind of quite a swift turnover? Are you already thinking about the next record? I'm always writing. I never stop writing. I never stopped writing after my first record. It's just when it comes together, it comes together, you know? How much have you been writing? Oh, stop it. You're so <laughs> cheeky. <laughs> um, Courtney Love won our Icon Award tonight. Okay, yeah. Are you a fan of Courtney? I Is love she Courtney. Some... Yeah, she's a friend of mine. Oh, really? Yeah. And was the whole kind of like a band you were into when you were younger? Is her music? Yeah, definitely. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Sure. And also Robin has won an award tonight as yes. well. Do you know Robin as well? Are you we met once very briefly in a dingy like bar in New York about five years ago. Okay. So it was nice to be reunited tonight and have a little catch up. Brilliant. Thank you very much. Thank you so much. Have a good night. Cheers. You too.